Bonnie Hart. I make music. Two step, two step. People compare two step. it to uh, like Michael Jackson or Prince a lot. Um, it's really funky, there's a lot of synth sound. Feels like looking at a magazine. The way I got to where I am now, as far as a musician, um, practicing with a dance company to become a... I, I thought I was going to become a professional dancer, dance hip-hop, and loved, loved all sorts of dance since I was a little kid. I had a, had a friend who played guitar, and I thought, you know, hey, let me practice on your guitar. Eventually, I asked my mom for one, and she got me one, and, and I just started learning from there. Uh, a lot of it was just sort of melody based from like songs that I just liked, but eventually um, noticing other guitarists and trying to emulate other guitarist uh, works. And uh, eventually I got in this band, started playing bass, and, and then singing started to matter a little bit. And, and uh, I think having friends and always liking dance music, always liking, um, you know, my mom would listen to LaBouche and, uh, you know, all that like crazy workout 90s music. So all that stuff, little by little, kind of like uh, molded into, into what I'm doing now. The way I got involved with the show is through Daryl Ratcliffe, uh, mainly. He, he's been coming to a few of my shows. I've uh, sat and played guitar with uh, his best friend, Danny Church. He said, hey, so I think you'd be a perfect fit for this event we're throwing that's uh, really art driven. And he just asked if I wanted to do it. I followed up and yeah, it's pretty simple. I don't know, I, I agreed, it sounded great. Plan on releasing an album soon. Uh, it's called You're Mine, um, without the E. So it's going to be kind of a fun play on words of uh, a few different meanings. So if, if I were to give a kid advice, it would be to it would, it would be to, to not be afraid to express yourself. Just like a a feeling of love and, and, and hope and knowing that, that that exists all the time.